Hi there and welcome back to this week's Tiny Tip. This week we're going to take a look at the D7 chord and I'll give you a couple of ways you can play it. The seventh chords are really lovely on ukulele. I really recommend trying to um, get all of those into your toolkit because they just come up a lot in ukulele music and just sound really lovely on the lightness of the ukulele strings. So seventh chords all the way, they're lovely. All right, let's get started. D7, there's a couple ways we're gonna do it today. The first way, which is my personal favorite way to play it, is going to be barring across the second fret, which means I'm going to place my finger down across all of the strings. I like to use my middle finger for this one. And on the second fret, we're going to do that. On the third fret, we're going to use the ring finger or third finger to play on the first string. Again, remember we count strings from the floor up. So that is our string number one, our, our A string, which is going to ring out with a beautiful high C now. This is the sound you'll get. It is a lovely sound on the ukulele. Uh, and while we're practicing. Now the other version that you can try if you'd like, which is a little bit more comfortable for some people, and I like to go back and forth between them depending on what I'm playing. Um, this one is the two finger version. So you're gonna take one finger, you're gonna put it on the second fret fourth string, and then you're gonna put the next finger on the second fret second string. You're gonna get this slightly deeper sound. Uh, and now you, of course, got the A ringing out high. Um, so, you know, it can sometimes work in um, different ways. You know, if, you, if you'd like a little bit deeper sound or warmer sound on that D7 chord instead, sometimes that's a better option. Um, but I do challenge you to try and learn both versions and have them both available to you because sometimes you need to go back and forth between both. And you might prefer one or the other. Anyway, that's it. Have fun with your D7 chord and we'll see you next time.